Hey, what's up guys? So I had an excellent question today. Uh, for those of you who are doing my 12-week Shredded Transformation Challenge, on push A, which is the chest workout, at the very end, it's one of my favorite ab exercises called the ab pull down. And you do it right here. And the way the exercise works is you hold the bar like this with your palms facing in, and then you perform the movement by holding the bar behind your neck and then doing a crunch. So I'll do one real quick. Just like this. And you're doing that for 30 repetitions. And one of the questions that I had from somebody was, what do you do if you can't hold the bar the entire time because your forearms start to give out before your core does? And a lot of you guys ask me what I do for my forearms in order to get them to look the way they do. And to be honest with you, I don't specifically target my forearms in any of my workouts. However, what I do is on every single exercise where I have to grip a bar, I squeeze it as hard as I can to get some like static isolation in the forearm. Anyways, from squeezing the bar as hard as you can, even though you're not actually doing anything with your wrist, you're still causing all the muscle fibers in this area to be activated. And because you're doing a static hold the entire time, you're activating your forearms even though you're crunching your abs. And so my point of this is, if you're trying to build stronger forearms, when you get to an exercise like this, where your forearms start to give out about halfway through the movement or during the movement at any time, utilize that mentally as a way to say, oh, if I keep doing this and I push through it, I'm gonna get my forearms to be stronger and I could even actually build some muscle because I'm stimulating that area a lot. So it's gonna get to the point where you're gonna push through it and finish all the repetitions. And as soon as you, as soon as you let go of the bar, you're gonna like shake your hands out because it's gonna hurt so much. But remember, what does that mean? It means you're working the area. So think about that the next time you guys are doing ab pull downs, not only are you working your abs, but you can also utilize it as an opportunity to hit those forearms extra hot as well. Hope you guys enjoyed this quick tip. See you next time. What's that for? I'm trying to, I'm trying to get my, my pump back so I can get a good photo for the tab for this video. How do you think, babe? Looks good. <sighs> Forearms look good. All right, now while I get the pump, let's get the photo. <laughs> <laughs>